In this video, I will guide you what to do with your Galaxy Tab S6 that becomes completely dead and won't turn back on. There are Galaxy Tab S6 owners that reported that their device turned off without apparent reason after the Android 10 update and would no longer respond to a turn on after that. While it may seem like a serious problem, as long as your device doesn't have physical or liquid damage, you should be able to fix it using a very simple solution. If you're one of them, here's what you need to do. First solution, do the forced restart. Most of the time, when a Dabble it powers down by itself, the problem is caused by a system crash. It's when the firmware stops working, and if that happens, naturally your tablet will become unresponsive while being stuck on a black screen. Press the volume down button and the power key at the same time, and hold them together for 10 seconds. If the logo shows, release both keys and wait for your tablet to finish the reboot. The forced restart is all you need to do to make an unresponsive tablet work again. However, if it doesn't fix the problem, then move on to the next solution. Second solution, charge your tablet and do the forced restart. After a few tries of doing the forced restart and your Galaxy Tab S6 is still not turning on, then it is possible that the problem is actually due to a depleted battery. Having a drained battery is basically not a problem, because more often than not, a tablet will immediately respond once it's connected to the charger. But there is always a possibility that the firmware may crash just before the tablet power is down. And that could be the case here, so try this. Plug the charger to a working wall outlet. Using the original cable, connect the tablet to its charger. Regardless of whether the tablet shows the charging symbol or not, leave it connected to the charger for at least 10 minutes. After which, and while the tablet is still connected to the charger, press the volume down button and the power key at the same time, and hold them together for 10 seconds. If the logo shows, release both keys and wait for your tablet to finish the reboot. If the tablet powers on, then the problem is fixed and it could have been due to a pretty minor firmware issue. However, if the tablet is still not responding after this, then it's time you have it checked. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos in the future. Thanks for watching.